Um, and then, because each of these solos, you could you could bust out. And just... they're, they're they're great. They really sound. You know, I like the bouncing and good beat. Yeah. Sure. Number four, three, four. on the on that turnaround mm -hmm. if you go you can do one okay. I'll, I'll write it there but an E flat it's just like a little a little extra percussive little thing okay. it gives it a little bit more oof in the bass if oof is what you're looking for okay right. that one and then number three three bounce bouncy wrist relax especially this one this is can get a lot of tension but you got to work mm -hmm. up to this one mm -hmm. it's not from the elbow it is from the wrist so just do it really quiet at first i know you want to yeah. just but that's not what we're doing you got to work up to that so let's go I started thinking about something. Like that. Just a little, mm -hmm. little kick. Mm -hmm. Again, these things, it's not like we're we're getting more and more complicated and that's how it goes it's the most complicated version it's just how you're feeling you want to be able to kind of go back and forth mm -hmm. whatever you feel like doing at any given moment uh and then number two right we haven't done this one yet. Mm -hmm. okay so we go <laughs> Graceful and really light and really in control when you've got it right. It's a very special type of feeling. Um, okay. Uh, and then the bounce, the second bounce is just like the first bounce, except you're breaking. So. It's only every other measure. It's the same exact thing. Oh. And what that does, it's, it's important to be able to do it and yeah. then do uh, start and stop, I guess, is, is, yeah. a, is a way to think about it. Um, um, yeah, it's, re it's really hard to explain, but if you're like, if you're just playing along and you just want to go, it has to be in there. <laughs> 